Good morning everyone, I'm here to do a 188 today on Weight Watchers Freestyle. It is also day one of Step Into Tracking. If you're interested in seeing what I'm going to eat today, then stay tuned for this so video. So I just put, um, made up two of the two ingredient bagels. I actually got some of this seasoning from Epicure, one of my members um, and friends sells like jalapeno and cheese um, seasoning and I'm obsessed with jalapeno bagels and I've been seeing these so I thought better way to try it than make my own jalapeno bagels so I did the two ingredients except for I made my own self-rising flour so it's flour with baking soda salt and Greek yogurt each bag will be three points I also put a teaspoon of this in the whole mixture and then I sprinkled just a tiny little bit on top and then literally the most minuscule amount of this like I know I can have 17 grams for a point and it was less than that, so I'm gonna say that the like it was probably like three, not even three grams of cheese on each bagel. So um, I'm not gonna count that, but they'll be three points each. Um, if I like this, I will make this as like a cook with me video. But I wanted to like test it out first. So while these are cooking, I'm drinking my Timmy Skinny Up. It really helps me with my cravings, especially when I'm trying to be on plan. So I'm having that. Don't go anywhere without it. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys when these guys are done in the oven. Also, Kirsten Amber is co-hosting this with me, um, stepping and tracking this year. She's on the Facebook page. She's pretty active as well. Um, and she's got a YouTube channel. So don't forget to go subscribe to her and check out her step into tracking videos. She's a vegan on Weight Watchers, so you'll see lots of different options from her. And um, she's just a great girl. So go check her out. Totally slipped my mind yesterday in the video to mention it. I know I'd mentioned it a couple videos back, but um, don't forget to go watch her videos. I was just about to take my vitamins and I thought I would show you guys what I'm taking. Um, basically, I just, I feel best when I'm taking these guys consistently, so I thought, I mean, it's not just what I'm eating, but I thought I would show you. I'm sorry, my kids are so noisy right now. So I've been taking magnesium citrate. Well, when I do take it, it really helps with my migraines, um, but you have to be consistent and take it like four times a day. So I'm going to start taking this guy again, and I'll give you an update with how it's helping. Um... One to three capsules daily. So I'm gonna take it three times a day, morning, lunch, and dinner, or morning, lunch, and dinner. Um, I take two of these hair, skin, and nails gummies like right when I wake up with, gut with biotin because I found um, either it's postpartum from Edison or weight loss or just like stress or like depression or whatever has been really killing my hair. So I've been taking these. This is my second bottle. I do really like them. And then also I'm gonna take iron because I'm always on iron and when I do get back into taking iron, my body feels way better. So I'm gonna take those as well. Let me see what the dose is, because I haven't been taking them. I, I follow the habits really easily, so I thought if I vlog about it, I'll remember. Um, I can't figure out where it says. I just take one. Anyways, I'll figure it out and I'll put it on the screen. So this is what my breakfast looks like. It's one of the bagels. I sprayed on some spray butter on the top half. Um, I can't believe it's not butter. I know if you make three bagels, you get their two points each, but I kind of wanted the size of a 3.1. So um, they feel nice. I didn't toast them or anything because it's still warm. I'm wondering if I eat the one later toasted, I might like it even better than this one. Um, just because I did feel like the center felt a little doughy. Still, not doughy, like it was cooked. But um, I like my bagels really toasted. So I have the three-point bagel with a little bit of this, which is zero points. It's from the States. <coughs> you can't get it in Canada. I'm sorry, guys. And then I have an egg with just some salt and pepper in it. Um, and then a clementine. This is my breakfast. I will let you know my thoughts Mommy. once I eat. So the bagel was delicious. I'll definitely make that again. I may put more cheese next time. Um... Yeah, and maybe add some turkey bacon because it's like one point. We would make it four points for breakfast instead of three. So probably would add some turkey bacon because I think it would just add extra flavor. But it was really good as a breakfast sandwich. Um, I think I'm actually going to use the other three-point ba three bagel for my lunch. I'm going to make like a turkey sandwich and um, maybe have a small bowl of soup for lunch. So what I'm doing now, the kids just went down for their nap. 
I'm gonna flip you around and show you what I'm doing. So Melissa's weight loss journey sent me like a box of stuff. I do not know what fuzz this is. A box of stuff for Christmas. And in it was this 2018 planner. It's kind of just like super basic. Um, super, super basic. And it's a monthly plan. So like every single page is just the month. There is a overview of like of each month but it also has things like birthdays and whatever um but I thought since step into tracking starts this month I'm gonna make this monthly view about step into tracking because I do have a big calendar up on the wall ignore my disaster of a house we just got home yesterday but I do have a big calendar up on the wall there for appointments or whatever and I can still put work and whatnot in here but this is going to be tracking I'm gonna put like my water like check marks for water I'm gonna put my um, steps and then I'm gonna put um, points on here I'm not gonna write down all of my foods in here I don't think unless I decide to put like a little paper here for like each week that I'm what I'm eating but I don't think right now that's what I'm gonna do but I'm just gonna get this decorated I'm also planning to do my body boss workouts again I fell off the wagon like to be honest guys I love this workout but um my head has just been in such a funk um the last few months ever since my open funeral in September which is when I started this it's kind of been like an on and off again thing I need to put my ring back on I find whenever I take a bath or wash my hands I take it off and then sometimes I forget okay anyways um so I'm gonna restart this and I think I'm gonna just start from week one again not the pre-training though so yeah right here so I'm going to mark that on here as well so it's Monday Wednesday and Friday and then they suggest like yoga and stuff on these guys um but I'm kind of just gonna do up my planner um and then also I pulled out the new cookbook I'm going to mark a few recipes I want to try and maybe try to plan some meal prep on Sundays um, with a couple food ideas have some other ideas that I already want to try so put in some food ideas do meal prep again and then also Melissa got me this little girl boss journal so I think I'm gonna start journaling um, daily um, while I'm doing step into tracking but just like to keep my thoughts straight because I have like the worst memory lately and um, I'm notorious for buying journals and not using them and this one is totally speaks to me it's floral and it's gold so I think it's a new year I'm gonna start journaling daily that's my plan even if it's just something small I'm gonna write a little something every day so I do that and in here is just a bunch of pens I'll show you guys when I finish I might not decorate it super cute today but I'm gonna just write in all right, so this is what I came up with. I might put some like washi up here, or, like a sticker here or down here or something, but this is what I came up with for now. So I have like a little, I don't know, an atlas. Um, basically, whenever I drink a glass of water, I'm going to put it here. I'm not measuring my water. Um, I'm just like, if it's a glass of water, I'm counting it as a glass of water. Um, I'll probably will drink like eight or ten a day. I generally get my water if I'm trying, so... I only had two so far. I'm going to go have one in a minute. My weight this morning. Oh my gosh, you guys. I'm sure that like four pounds of that is going to come right off. Like I'm probably going to lose like crazy amount of weight in the first week because, you know, like last week I was down to like 171 or two or something. I don't even know. Anyways, that's really high. Not impressed to see that number, but I thought every Monday I'll put my weight or if I step on the scale during the week, I'll just put it in here. So this is the atlas. So water is, I'm going to draw a little like water droplets. And then um, at the end of each day, I'm going to write my steps in here in light purple. Um, I, on body boss days, I have my workout written in. Um, and then um, light green is going to be the points I use that day. So I'll write that in. Um, and then I have my red pen. I'm going to use any gym activity I do other than... Um, my gym activity other than Body Boss is going to be written in red. Um, I think I'm going to try to get some cardio in today. We will see. I do have a bit of a headache probably because I'm cutting sugar. Like I had a clementine this morning, but I'm not going to have any added sugar today. So that's going to be uh, probably a hard hurdle to get through for me. Huh. So I might just do my Body Boss today. We will see. 
I'm going to walk around my house and get some steps in though because my steps are low still. Um, and then I have um, vitamins. So I actually need to take two magnesium in the morning and two at night. So every time I take my magnesium, I'm checking this, I'm obviously going to take my hair vitamins and my um, folic acid with the first check, but just checking them off so I don't forget to take them. What did I just get on here? Okay, and then um, I'm also doing my detox for or with Timmy. So um, every other night I have my colon tea on here because I find I forget sometimes to do that. Um, and then I just wrote track water steps, just kind of keep that in my head. And then I planned some foods I want to do this week. I think I'm going to make breakfast bagel sandwiches and wrap them up, put them in the fridge. So they'll be easy to um, have on hand. So I'll batch make some bagels either today or tomorrow. And then I have, I want to do boiled eggs and turkey roll-ups for lunches. Um, I also want to make some soup to have in the freezer. And then I was thinking about doing um, my pad thai or some sort of variation of that for dinner if the grocery stores are open because I don't have groceries for that in the house. So we will see how that happens. And then next week I know I want to do salmon patties with Greek dip and salad, um, chia pudding, overnight oats, and then I want one more dinner. Generally, we only do like two big dinners through the week, and then we just eat the leftovers, like alternate. Um, my husband doesn't seem to have a problem with that, and he can always make something on some of the nights at work. But yeah, that is my thing. I did journal as well, um, but uh, I'm not going to share it with you. <laughs> just kind of how I've been feeling and whatnot. So I did journal as well. And I got this out, so I'm going to get some steps. I'll do this later. I don't think I'm going to do it when the kids are napping because it could be a little noisy. Um, generally, some of the, I'll just show you, some of the workouts are like, like i got to jump around and stuff and I don't want them to wake up. So that is that. Um, I got to do some tidying as well and I'll see you in a bit. So cutting sugar after the holidays is not going very well. I feel groggy and my head is pounding. I know after a couple days we will be fine um, so I just made myself lunch I also filled up my tea again um, I'll flip you around show I'm you what lunch is other bagel um, I toasted it a little bit but I should have toasted it longer because it's not crunchy um, put a bit of spray butter and then just put turkey breast on there so the turkey breast is zero the bagel is three then I have some sugar snack peas for zero um, I need to clear my counter because I've got candy canes and these things however they're not really tempting me that bad um another temptation that's out what was it oh let's see breakfast pizza from the mother-in-law she sent home with us and that's really the only tempting thing in my freezer um we do have candy cane ice cream in my freezer but you know what i'm like really being headstrong i just put on jeans and they are really tight and like not cute tight okay so I'm going to eat this. Apparently we're going to Swiss LA for dinner with my dad. So I think I'm going to get a quarter chicken white. Um, I'll eat the skin so I'll count it as like a point or two. And let's see if I can get myself to get a salad. Because Lord knows I'd want those fries. We'll see how I'm doing for points. Um... I might just get a kid's meal and then it will help in general. Mm. Gonna go. Okay, so I ended up getting chicken tenders and fries and a bun. Tracked it. I'm only three points over my daily points, so that's good. The chicken tenders were tossed in buffalo wing sauce. Um, I kind of had a hard time just saying no. Um, I'm not gonna eat out though. Like I have no, I have no plans of eating out the rest of the week, so. It is what it is. I was only three points over. I'm tracking it. Um, then I came home and I had a cup of tea after putting the kids to bed at 7 .30. That was just a cup of teeny relax. It's like my favorite thing like when I'm tired at the end of the night and I just need to like unwind. So anyways, I had that. Currently I'm getting the rest of my steps in for the night. I'm going to edit this vlog and get it up. So in the morning I'll let you know how many steps I ended up getting, but I got to get off here. I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching and see you tomorrow for day two. Bye.